Hey, what's up everybody? I just wanted to talk about something that's bothering me quite a bit, and that's going to be the whole ne neutrality thing. So I just want to talk about what it is, maybe educate a few people about what's actually going on, because it's some really scary shit. Uh, so what is net neutrality? Net neutrality is a, a set a set of laws. It keeps big cable companies and wireless companies from being able to determine or limit our access to certain websites. Like being able to have a bundle for social media. So your Twitters, your Instagrams, your Facebooks. On top of your normal internet charge, they can tack on a package. Well, this is our social media bundle. If you would like unlimited access without any throttling, that's going to be an extra $5 a month on your bill. That doesn't make sense to me. That's really stupid. It's like buying a car and then Chevrolet saying you can only drive on this freeway, but if you pay an extra X amount of money You can drive on this freeway with less traffic. That don't make sense And the the main proponent behind this is a Jeep pie a former Verizon employee This also means that companies could limit our access to news say something Donald Trump does and he doesn't want X company wanting you to be able to see that well, he can call over and be like, hey, these guys over here, we, we, I don't want them seeing that. I'm going to need you to block their, their connection to that site. He can then say, I'll scratch your back, you scratch mine. Which is going to be legal! So what do we do? Voices need to be heard. I'm going to put links in the description so you can get in contact with the people that you need to. And voice your opinion because this is crazy. This has ramifications for everyone. Say you're a gamer. Okay, well, on top of your normal monthly bill, in order to download your games from Steam or Origin or wherever you get your games, you'll have to get the, the premium video game bundle, which could add an extra 10 to $15 a month on your bill. What kind of sense does that make? It's not treating the internet as a utility anymore. Everything's going to be in bundles. That's... I, for one barely pay for what I have. But like I said, this also goes towards wireless companies. AT&T, Verizon, T-Mobile. They don't want you watching Netflix? Well, they can promote Hulu. Hulu, you get our service, you get internet with us, you automatically get Hulu. But now Netflix, it's going to be half your bandwidth. But if you pay this premium, you can have your Netflix streaming HD. I don't know how this happened. But if you have any more questions, just leave it down in the comments. I'd love to help people understand what's actually going on. Thank you for watching. And please do your part. Guys, this is crazy. The fact that this is happening. They will actually be voting on this on December 14th. That's not very long from now. We need net neutrality to stay in place. Because if we don't, that's the end of the internet as you and I both know it. Plus, what kind of incentives are these companies going to have to upgrade the infrastructure? If they can just keep charging people to upgrade their packages back to where they used to be, why would they do anything to make anybody's internet faster? They won't! The money's not there. They're not going to do it. So please, let your voice be heard. I, I thank you for watching my video. If you have any questions, just leave them in the comments. Thank you all, and have a blessed day.